Well, hello, my beautiful family, and thank you so much for being with me here today. My name is Alan, and this is Never Far Enough. For today's topic, I'll make it real brief, real quick, I promise. It was just that this morning, today is April 3rd, and this morning my mom texted me and said, hey, this was Easter week, you know, Good Friday, and you haven't talked about the crucifixion of Jesus and it didn't came it didn't came to my mind you know so i was like oh, man it would have been a good opportunity to talk about it but i'm a little late at this point so i just wanted to share one of my favorite verses in the bible about the crucifixion of jesus so that's what we're going to be reading together today All right, so let's get right into it. The verse that I, that I, one of my favorite verses is Isaiah 53 verses 2 to 9, but it's a, it's a long verse. I invite you to read it, but we're just going to read a portion of it right here with my electronic Bible. And the verse says this, but he was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement for our peace was upon him, and by his stripes we are healed. So yes, my dear friend, Jesus died for you as he died for me. He died for all of us for the sole purpose of paying the price that we had to pay death. I love how Ellen White puts it in her book, The Desire of Ages. I'm going to read this quote from that book here. It says, Christ was treated as we deserve, that we might be treated as he deserves. He was condemned for our sins in which he had no share that we might be justified by his righteousness in which we had no share. He suffered the death which was ours, that we might receive the life that was his. With, with his stripes, that was the verse that we just read, with his stripes we are healed. And I praise Jesus for that. I love him for that. And I hope that you as well develop a relationship with him very tight. He loves you. As, as the title of this channel says, he's never far enough from you. He's just a prayer away, a conversation away. Just call upon his name and receive his peace. Thank you so much for being with us here today. I ask that God bless you and your family in the name of Jesus. And until next one, friend, take care.